And this is what arrivals look like in a queuing system. Um, for us healthcare folks, what it, what it basically is, it's atrial fibrillation. It's atrial fibrillation. It's not sinus rhythm. In a queuing system, there is some predictability, but it's not perfectly predictable. And that's one of the reasons we have so much trouble. So just think of it as atrial fibrillation. There are clusters, and that tends to destroy uh, continuous throughput throughout the system. So let's talk about what else this means. So this is, this is the uh, patient arrival curve from one of our emergency departments. And this is time of day along the horizontal axis, and vertical axis is the number of patients. But here's the interesting thing. This is one of my ERs, but the curve is also yours. This curve holds for every ER in the United States. That's why we can start to say the number of patients arriving per hour is different ER by ER, but the curve is the same. And that's how you can start to think of ER flow as being predictable. 